Hey guys, what's up again? It's Dan from CryptoCamacho.com, where each day I help guide you through this crazy cryptocurrency revolution. Today, guys, I want to do a follow-up on a video I made just a few days ago around pump groups, pump and dump groups. I want to make a follow-up video because now I've had a little bit of experience with the groups, directly observing them, directly watching the pumps that they engage in, not actually participating in them myself, but actually watching them you know, from how they construct the pumps to actually going out and carrying out the pumps, I want to show you exactly kind of what has happened, what it looks like. And I want to caution you a little bit about these pump groups because they're not all that they cr are cracked up to be, right? Everything that's being advertised, everything they're telling you, how you can make easy money, how you can fight against the whales and, you know, stick it to the man, not necessarily all it's cracked up to be. And I want to show you exactly what I'm talking about here in just a sec. So guys, if you haven't seen my previous video about pump and dump uh, groups, go to my YouTube channel and you'll be able to find it there in the videos. But essentially what a pump and dump group is, it's something that uh, a group or an individual will, or will organize and they'll get thousands and sometimes hundreds of thousands of people to participate in these pump groups through the Telegram app or through the Discord app or websites or web pages. And at the right time, what they'll do is they'll announce that on X, you know, X date and at X time, we're going to pump a coin. Often it happens on Binance, often it happens on Bittrex or maybe another exchange, but they'll do a, they'll have a coordinated effort to get everybody included in the pump group to at the same time buy a particular coin on a particular exchange so that the price gets driven up, you know, to the moon, if you will, and people can make a quick buck before cashing out. They've been doing this in a couple of different ways, a couple of different flavors, and it seems like they're continuously trying to improve and refine the process. But honestly, from my experience so far, these are nothing but just hype, right? There has been no potential for profit in any of the pumps that I've seen. I've seen four of them now take place over the last, let's say, two weeks approximately. And each time I've seen them, I thought to myself, if I were to invest right now, and I just watched them, I just kind of watched what happened. But if I thought to myself, uh, you know, if I were to put money into this right now, $1,000, $10,000, you know, at where it is now, I would have lost money every single time. I would have lost a significant amount of money, which is why I am making this video to kind of, you know, to caution you guys about these pump groups. I'm not saying never participate in them, but just be very cautious of them. And I would just be careful of when you invest, you know, being very, very close to how you're investing, how much you're investing, the timing of when you're investing, so forth and so on. So let me give you a few examples uh, of what I'm talking about. So for you newbies that don't know what pump groups are, just go to Google, type in Bitcoin pump groups. You're going to get a whole host of results around what pump groups are, right? There's even websites now trying to organize these pump groups, whether or not they're legitimate, whether or not they're legal. I don't completely know. I would think that most of them are scammy. Uh, but again, I don't know. I'm going to keep kind of uh, researching this myself. Um, but I do want to show you the direct experience. So Interview with cryptocurrency pump and dump group, Telegram, uh, let's see, John McAfee pump and dump groups. I mean, these pump and dump groups are popping up, right? You can find them on Reddit. You can find out about them on Reddit. You can find out how they work on Steemit, a variety of different areas. And like, I mean, here, here's where it says it's an ad saying participate in 3000% pumps. Completely not the case. Um, if I go to like, let's say crypto pump groups, um, I'll probably get similar uh, results here. Uh, let's just say cryptocurrency pump groups get yeah get the similar beware crypto traders pump and dump groups on telegram pump and dump groups on telegram so i want to give it to you straight and show you exactly what i've observed so the channels that i belong to it's called the big pump signal bitcoin pump group um, if you look over here i have a discord uh account that is essentially giving me access to this big pump signal pump group here's their telegram link you can get the telegram app on my phone i have a telegram app um, I have the Discord app, and usually when they notify you about the pump, the pumps that are going to happen, they'll do it on the apps. So they'll do it on Telegram, they'll do it on Discord. Sometimes they'll do it on Twitter, but I'd say the most reliable place is on Telegram. So if you do want to check out these pump groups, you can go to this uh, link right here up in the top, check this out, sign up to Discord. You can also sign up to the uh, Telegram group, which is really where it happens. But again, be careful when you're doing this, guys. Um, I'm not promoting this. I'm just educating you guys on how this actually is working. So, so now this group called um, Big Pump Signal, they now actually have a website, bigpumpsignal.com. 
Uh, and basically, even a, even a small fish can beat a whale while in a strong group. So they're really touting and promoting that, hey, we are trying to pump up prices of cryptocurrencies because of the market manipulators and whales that are bringing the prices of Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies down. We're going to fight against them. We're going to fight against the man. In theory, I agree with that. And I think that's great. And I think that, you know, overall, that would be a great thing to do. But in reality, it's not really working like they're claiming it's working on their site, on their Discord channel, and on their Telegram app, right? If this changes, I'm happy to report otherwise, but it's just simply not the case of what they're promoting. So they say, we do pumps, big pumps, and we do it fair. Not true. The cryptocurrency market provides great opportunities. Are you going to stay away with your hands in your pocket while others make money? Big Pump Signal is the biggest cryptocurrency pump community worldwide. Unlike other pump groups, pump and dump groups, we have approved to be fair for all users. During our pumps, we spread tweets and other social media posts to get outsiders in. This way, most people in our group can make money. We choose coins with a lot of future potential, so people won't get stuck when the price goes down directly after the pump. That I tip, that I do agree with. They have picked coins that I think have longer term potential, which is great, right? But it doesn't mean you're going to make quick money on that actual pump that they organize at the time of the organized pump, right? Uh, okay, we will still be monitoring the market in order to maintain its uptrend, blah, 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 blah. We are going to rule the market and you are not, and you are the lucky one. We just launched our new referral ranking system. I am not going to put a referral link in this YouTube video right now because I have not seen this prove out well. And so I do not necessarily want to promote it. If you do want to go to it, you're welcome to go to pimp, bigpumpsignal.com. But again, I'm not endorsing this at all. Okay, so let's jump right into it. So I've participated on about four, maybe five pumps. Um, not participated on, sorry. I have observed about four or five pumps. And I want to show you exactly the ones that I've participated on. Uh, again, observed. I haven't participated on them. I keep using the wrong word. Okay, so first, ICN. So ICN was really kind of the first pump group that I witnessed and that I um, observed and watched it kind of play out. And if you look right here, let me mark this big right here, this big candle upwards is what I saw. And when I saw it was on January 15th. So on January 15th, right, the price of the ICN cryptocurrency went up about 120, 115 to 20% literally within let's just zoom uh in here to the five minute charts so literally within the span of about five to 15 minutes the price went up 120 percent that is definitely by any definition a pump but the problem is is that when i get the notifications on the app and let me just open it up to show you what i'm talking about here let me log into the telegram app okay so this is the telegram app right here I don't know if, how well you can see it, but here's the Telegram app. You go, you know, big pump signal, and here's kind of the messaging that they give you. I know you can't see the words, but this is what they give you. And typically a day or two before the pump happens, they'll start sending messages to that uh, Telegram group saying, get ready for the big pump. The big pump is going to be on X date at X time. Get ready to do it. They'll give you some tips and recommendations of how to approach the pump. You know, uh, they may even tell you, you know, the price, the target price of where they're looking to buy in. They may give you the target price of where they're looking to sell. They may even tear that off, right? Because different pump groups act differently and have different requirements and so forth. Anyway, the first one I jumped in on uh, and, and was watching was, was this one, was ICN, right? And literally when they announced the coin, by the time they announced the coin on the pump group ICN, the price was literally already about 50% up. It was literally about up to here. When I, when, I, when I first even saw the message that it was ICN. So that's problem number one, right? They're, they're claiming that they're giving you a complete heads up into, you know, and to make it fair when you can get in on this pump, but that's not actually happening. Before the pump actually happens, you already see a tremendous number of people have already bought in on the coin and have already known that this was gonna be the coin that they pump. So they have a huge, huge advantage of getting in early to make money. And I'm sure who, who does this? It's probably the founders of the pump group, right? Maybe it's their close friends, their family, whatever, extended people. They claim that if you're an affiliate and you get X amount of people to sign up under you as an affiliate, you'll get a head start. You'll be given you know, the information about what coin is going to be pumped before anybody else. And typically they, they tier it. Typically it's like, you know, two seconds before anybody else or five seconds or six seconds. 
So in reality, it's only a couple seconds before anybody else, and, and that's by promoting these pump groups. So, so for example, if I were to promote a pump group on my YouTube channel and put my affiliate link there, um, they would say, you know, for everybody you get signed up, you'll get X amount of time, lead time, you know, to join the pump before anybody else knows about it, right? So if I invite a thousand people, maybe I'll get a four second head start to anybody else. Well, that's great, but four seconds, one, isn't very much, right? Two, you know, four seconds wouldn't have made any difference in this ICN chart at all. And so by the time I got in, you know, I, I looked at this and the price was already up to here, right? This particular, uh, um, this particular coin ICN, it's on uh, Binance, right? It's on the Binance exchange. That's where you need to trade it. When I went over to Binance to see if I even actually could buy ICN coin, Binance was locked up and frozen because of all the traffic hitting it, trying to participate in this pump group. So that's one interesting sign that they do have a lot of people trying to participate in these, bump gr uh, these pump groups. And it was clear to me, right? Because they were all trying to log into Binance at the same time. They were all trying to hit that uh, ICN um, coin and buy it at the same time. So that was the second problem. I couldn't even buy the coin if I wanted to because I was going to put, you know, like 50 bucks in just to see what would happen. Um, I couldn't even do it because Binance was locked up and I couldn't do it. So by the time I was even able to trade anything on Binance, the price had already gone way up, right? 120% and it was already really on its way back down. So, so that again is another problem that I saw with this. And then shortly thereafter, the price dips, you know, down um, from the starting point, it dips down about 4%, right? So that was a terrible way to make money and a terrible way, if I were to participate on this pump, I would have lost, you know, maybe 50, 70% of my initial capital. Don't do it guys, bad, bad move. The one trend I am noticing though, and I'll, I'll point it out here again at the end, is that typically after a pump, the price will go lower than where it started. And typically there's a run down and then there's another run up. I'll show you this in, a, in another few examples here in a sec, but let's jump over to another coin, another example of a pump, right? The next pump group that I saw was uh, BNT, BNT, right? Uh, and on, uh, I think this one, um, I gotta go check, let me check. Hold on one sec, guys, I'm gonna pause this. All right, the next one that I just had to check the date of when I uh, actually did it. Okay, so the next one was on the 20th. So January 20th, they pumped, this group pumped BNT. And here's BNT right here on the 20th. So if you look at this big sharp candle right here, that's where the pump took place, guys. And if you look at the starting point, we were all the way, let's see, down here. And we went up. This one only went up about 25%. So it was not a huge pump. I would think it wasn't successful. They touted it as being extremely successful. And in reality, it wasn't. I mean, this is, again, a very similar situation that I just described in the last example where the pump went up very, very quickly within like five minutes, literally, and then just tanked all the way back down very, very quickly. Couldn't participate in it, you know, didn't participate in it. Um, and again, I would have lost a lot of money if I did participate in it. The next one which is, uh, let's see, X, uh, XZC. And this one was on, uh, uh, let's see, it was on this, this right here, January 23rd. Let me just double check the app uh, to make sure that's the right date. Let's see, the 20th, XZ, 23rd. Yep, yes, it was on the 23rd and they sent a little picture. I don't know if you can see it. They sent a little picture with a bunch of coins in it. XCC is the one that they wanted you to pump, right? That's been viewed 75,000 times, so people definitely are watching these. But again, look what happened, guys. And the price shot up, so we were down. We were down, starting point was, let's see, about, I mean, the day before, like earlier in the day, you can see it right here. I mean, earlier that, like the 22nd, the price was really down, right? Then on the 23rd, the price stabilizes to 006, and then it goes all the way up from 006 all the way up about, you know, again, about 15%. Not a whole lot. Not a whole lot, guys. And, and, and that's where, and let me just zoom out. Okay, these are the hour charts. Let me zoom out to the five-minute charts. Um, okay, the 23rd. Let me go zoom back out. Sorry, guys. This is uh, usually, okay, I'll, I'll just go back to the hours. It's easier to see. Okay, so the 23rd. 
So again, not a huge, this is the 23rd right here. Again, not a huge lift. I mean, again, it's it's only it's only like 20%. That happens like almost every day in the cryptocurrency market. So, so it's not a huge deal. But the people that got in down here, right, they got in at the bottom and they made that 20% or whatever it is, 15% because they got in earlier. When I looked at this and when they announced it on Telegram, the price was already about up to here. So already halfway up. So it didn't even make sense to participate in this pump because you know it's going to go up a little more, but then it's going to go down and you never know when that's going to actually happen. So if you are interested in participating in pump groups, what I would do is I would watch them go all the way up to the top and then I would literally watch them fall all the way back down, down to here, right? Because if you were to get in when, when the drop happened right here, you could have very, very easily made a quick like five to 10%. In this case, it was about 7%, right? And that 7% held strong for a very long time. And I think people were selling off because they were panicking a little bit that the pump caused the price to dip so much they didn't know how low it was actually gonna go. And so that's what I would recommend if you're gonna participate in pump groups, watch the pump happen and watch the pump dip back down because it will typically dip below where it started, which will basically... Um, propel a lift up. And that's what I'm going to start doing when watching these pumps moving forward. And I wanted to give you guys kind of the, the, the straight from the mouth about how this would actually, uh, how these pump groups actually work. So take it or leave it. You know, this is my experience with pump groups. There's another one, KMD, you know, similar, very, very similar situation. Take it for what it's worth. But guys, if you do want to participate in pump groups, go up for it. You know, I'm not endorsing it or recommending it. I'm just giving you my experience. If this turns around and I see that it is very, very possible to make money in these pump groups, I'll let you know. I'll make a video about it and I'll show you exactly what happened. The next pump group I see, the next one that happens, I'm going to try my strategy where I'm going to wait till the pump goes all the way up and I'm going to wait for it to crash back down. And I'm going to see if it's a viable opportunity to invest on the dip so I can buy the dip again. Um, before it goes back up. And that's what I'm going to try to do moving forward. Would love to know your thoughts on this. Love to know if you guys have participated in pump groups, what you think about them, if they're scams, if you made money on them or not. I'm Dan from CryptoCamacho.com. And if you haven't subscribed, please click on that little red button that says subscribe, guys. I will talk to you later and hopefully you enjoyed this video. See you guys.